impossible not to be extraordinarily moved by the bravery of the police commissioner, his wife, Emma, and the entire Stevens family, particularly um, penning their letter about their most beloved son, Charlie. Um, I think it's also an incredible point in time where there has been a collective grief around another road fatality. Uh, and Charlie was loved by his family and each and every person that has lost their life on our roads this year has been equally loved and equally grieved. Uh, what I hope and what I harbour some optimism in amongst this horrible set of circumstances is that people will be shocked into action. That this type of grief is horrible. This type of mourning for a loved one is the most painful, painful of human experiences. And what we must do, each and every one of us, and each person is moved by the courage of the Stevens family to use that as motivation. You have that motivation to speak to your children at the dinner table tonight about what they can do to stay safer. Speak to your friends and loved ones. Um, for yourself, take that motivation to take really simple, easy steps to get safer outcomes on our roads. Amongst all of this grief, amongst all of this tragedy, there has to be something that comes from it. And what I'm seeing in front of my eyes is a collective acceptance by our community that enough is enough. Yeah, look, um, I do want to be really careful about talking about private matters here. Um, this is private grief from the Stevens family and of course every person who mourns a loved one. But can I say that the um, support provided to police and the police family at the moment more broadly is outstanding. Um, I have seen police um, both simultaneously mourn and step up to the job of the next task, the next, the next call, the next job. I also want to make a, a special note of thanks to the leadership of Acting Police Commissioner Linda Williams. Um, she in herself is an outstanding leader. Um, she herself has dedicated a lifetime of service to the community of South Australia. And I know that on both a personal level to the Stevens family, but also a professional level to the Border Police family, um, she and her leadership has been simply outstanding. And I thank Linda uh, on behalf of the government for her leadership. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we'll just...